Drinking at college has become a ritual that students often see as integral to their higher education experience. The first six weeks of freshman year are a vulnerable time for heavy drinking and alcohol-related consequences because of student peer pressure and expectations. Many drink not because they want to, but because they wish to fit in and feel accepted. Peer pressure is one of the main reasons someone starts to drink in the first place. The concept behind peer pressure is based on the social identity theory. Humans are naturally social creatures, and we often define ourselves by peer groups. These groups help people feel connected to something bigger than themselves and force many people to do whatever is necessary to stay in that peer group. Some students arrive at college with an already established drinking habit. Underage drinking in college is illegal and comes with real consequences. Being caught drinking underage in college can result in a criminal record that can follow students for the rest of their lives. These criminal offenses will go on a student's criminal history and could result in the loss of scholarships or expulsion. Researchers estimate that each year, over 1,500 college students between the ages of 18 and 24 die from unintentional injuries related to alcohol. This includes motor vehicle crashes. Choosing to stay sober in college is going to be a significant challenge. You are going to be surrounded by people who are getting drunk or high almost every night. As a result, you might feel urged to succumb to the temptation to fit in or have fun at a party. However, you can still hang out at these parties without using substances. Good friends will understand and support your sobriety, 